Hi everyone, right, I did do a video the other day, um, but yet again, camera didn't record, so I'm going to do it again, um, last time I'd done it in blue, this time I'm doing it in pink, not sure if I'm going to use these two because they stay red, even though they don't look red at all, so I'm going to leave that to the side, um, that is a rose gold, so it's, it's not really a pink, I don't suppose, but it is a pink. I might use that, I might not. Um, that's the rose, that's just normal pink, that is goggly gook, that is goggly gook, and that is not a clue. <laughs> really handy. <laughs> Right, well, this is the mould. That's the lid. That's the mould. I think you're going to have to move up. Wait a minute. Hopefully, sorry, hopefully you're going to be able to see and I won't keep knocking you. Okay, so this is like a jewellery box. Um, I think, I'm sure I got the mould off of Good old Timu. Um, it's got all these bits here on the sides as well. So I'm going to turn it inside out and uh, colour all these in. Um, sorry, I'm trying to get some of the blue out that's left <laughs> behind. Um, when you uh, open it, You've got this bit, which is the wood, and believe me, that is a tight fit. I struggled actually to get them right down, so that probably won't ever come apart. And then you've got these inside to keep it um Oh, did you hear that noise? That was all my um, inks going over again. I've got to change that round. I've got it round the wrong way, I think. Keeps its shape. That's what I'm looking for. So I'm going to turn this one inside out again. Like this. And I'm going to... I'll do this one first. And I'm going to basically colour it all in. Different pinks hopefully it will look decent um and then what i'll do is once that's done i'm going to fill it up with uh with um resin that's got a little tiny bit of pink color to it just so it doesn't go funny colored but it's also going to have pink glitter oh, i'm going to find my pink glitter these are basically these are going to be for my grandkids um Anyway, let's get going. I'm going to do dark first because last time I done when I done the blue, I done the light first, and then I couldn't see where I needed to go. <laughs> right, okay, so I'm just going to shut up. Going to randomly put them on, and I'll just put some music on for you. In a perfect world, you're with me. In a perfect. World.
people these pinks are not coming out very well at all um so what i might do is um put some of the darker one on which was that one the rose gold and then just it over like i just did there's no point i don't think we're putting the others on there because you can't really see them that's the only problem with mica powder you just unless you've got it actually mixed into the resin they come out quite weak but before i do that this is what i do i'll get myself a baby wipe and this is what claire did in claire's craft corner it works out so much better than trying to do it um like like that right so 
roll it up and all I do is because I want the glitter to come through hoping anyway I did on the blue one like that there you go see and then that's all cleaned up I mean obviously it's not right underneath there but I'm not that bothered bothered not that bothered um I can't think what I was going to say now right so that's that done
that's it so now I'll turn this in the right way hopefully without messing it up if I can remember how <laughs> Bit, that bit <laughs> oh look um just didn't mean to do that it's gone all over it ah don't do that you silly stuff God. that would do <laughs> right I should give that a bit of a quick flick not that bothered because it's going to have glitter and pigment in it right so what i do now is put this back in here oh i've done it again i do apologize i'm constantly hitting the bloody thing I have to find another place for it, I think, and then slide it in there like that. So then, uh, last time I mixed up, I done deep pour because it is a deep pour, um, and I done. What did I do? Um, Trying to think what I put in it now. I think I've made about six hundred, about six hundred grams. I think because I've done it in oh in that. So I should get it down. Okay, got my deep pull. Um, sure, it was about 600 grams I done. Okay, so I shall mix up my resin and I shall be back. Because you don't want to sit there watching me stir for three to five minutes. <laughs> so I will be back. All right. I've made up way too much and I know I've done way too much so I'm going to use this peach to tint the resin I was going to say water then I just want it tinted don't want it colour coloured I want it tinted because resin as you probably know changes colour in the sun and over time but if you put a tint in it it should stay good okay that needs a little bit more I think As you can see, you don't need lots. Right. I can't believe I've made up so much. I've used all my, literally used all my deep pour. I've, I've done something wrong, I know I have. Because that should not be left over. Never mind, I'll soon find out if this doesn't cure <laughs> and I'll have to start another one. Okay, so what I'm going to do is put some silver glitter in because I haven't got any pink, which is a bit of a poo. I have to look for some. No, don't go in there, resin. Now, if you use fine glitter like this you will find it will float but if you use chunky glitters and things they're heavier so they will sink right okay so I'm gonna do that but I'm also 
I've got these from somewhere. I think Timu. Everything's from Timu now. <laughs> so I'm going to put some in there. I don't know if these will sink or if these will float. pink is it um and stick these little ones in as well these are little hearts i don't know if any of this is going to show once it's done these i think i got out of b and m as a, an english shop I need more colour in it. Just a bit. Another three. So that's about nine drops I think I've put in here. Alright. I think that's going to be it. don't know if it's put some more white lip. I'm going to put some more silver in it that's better and it needs a bit more of this doesn't but I want to put it in <laughs> that's better I'm happy with that now okay let's try and scrape as much as I can off as this is a deep pour um those who are new to resin this will take about 48 hours please don't put your arm in resin Sandra about 48 hours to to cure so here's the lid
Ah, yeah, these are all nice and dry. So I'm going to, right, I'm going to demold this one first. It's a, uh, oh, what's it to get out sometimes? Still feels a little bit bendy actually, this one. Hmm. It's been over 48 hours, I think. Oh, yeah, it's definitely bendy. <laughs> yeah, it's <is> definitely bendy. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I think that's back to shape. That's cute. I like that. I love the way the glitter's fallen down and made that a whole um, silvery top. Yeah. Are you there? I can't. Oh, I'm... Look, I'm doing it again. I am so sorry. Knee swore. But yeah, I think that's good. I like that. That's cute. These, I've made a couple of the little dishes and I've actually put them with my uh, plants on them. It's cute. Like, like, like that one. That one's gone on over there. Right, let's do mould in the right way. Right. Hope. Mm. Right. Let's have a go at this thing. <sighs> Am I in shot if I'm doing it this here? Let me move you a bit, a little bit. I do apologise. That's a bit better. Can't move the whole bleeding phone arm. Right. Let's see if I can get this out. This will be my younger out of the two granddaughters oh yeah it's still still bendy oh foof never mind i'll get it out and then i can let it sit nicely oh that's got a couple of bubbles oh get off get off get off thank you that's not too bad, not as bad as the blue one. The blue one had quite a few on the sides. Oh, that's quite cute. Not that bendy. That's quite cute, I think. Yeah, I like that. So let's get that out of the way. Right. Now for the big, big boy. So, I have to take him out of this bit. <laughs> Fingers and thumbs, people. Fingers and thumbs. <laughs> there goes me inks again. <laughs> I still haven't like, changed it. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Why do... is nothing simple for me getting out the bloody mouths? <laughs> I haven't got this out the mould yet. <laughs> it's coming. It's coming, people. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> cool. End up like Popeye for those who uh, remember him. All right, if you don't Google it, he's a sailor, cartoon sailor, and he's uh, eats spinach. <laughs> I don't eat spinach, but he eats spinach and he's got muscles that flex. Yeah, look, it's really uh, no. I'm not going to demold that yet. I'm going to put that back in there, that back in there, and I'm not putting it back in the fall. Right, I'll be back when that is completely cured. Hey, uh, this will be properly dried now, hopefully. Yes, so I can de demold it now. I've left it for another day. Oh, get the fingers in, in there to get that one out. Okay. A little bit it's uh yeah there's no overflow it's actually shrunk a little bit so that can be quite sharp sometimes you get a lot of bubbles like this look as well can you see yeah you can so i'm just checking the camera as uh those who watch me know that sometimes i don't get it in the camera <laughs> oh oh there's nasty ones there look so oh 
believe me when I struggle people it is a struggle it really is a struggle is it? I love this mold just love it oh just wish it was easier to come out gotcha <laughs> Done it. <laughs> Let's turn this back in the right way. Let me just quickly put me um, stuff together because otherwise I will forget and it will misshape and then I will cry because I like this mold. Right, so there's the lid. There's the lid. Right, okay. So there's the box. I think that's rather cute. When it comes to these, I think what I might do is just put a bit of um, UV in it just to fill these little ones in, up a little bit. Um, it does sit nicely. Okay. And I'll show you. Oh, ah. This is the blue one I made. One granddaughter likes pink. And the other granddaughter likes blue. So, oh, oh, thank you for that. Oh, <laughs> it's stuck together. So what I'm going to do is, I don't know what I've done with them now. Okay. I thought, let's put this over that side. I bought these off of um, Amazon. We got, these are, the uh, clasps for you to shut it all down so I've got gold and I've got antique and in here oh it's still taped hold on I only just got these today literally um, 10 minutes ago Oh, yeah, little monkey, where are you? Where, where are you sealed now? Nice. Hang on, peeps. I don't know where this one come open. I took the set. Cell ah, there's another bit of sellotape there. <laughs> oh, such a good one. <laughs> Look at that. It opens if you take your sellotape off. Oh, had a little screwdriver. Oh, that's good. And these are the little hinges. Look at them, they're so cute. I thought, oh, yeah. You, I've got some gold and some antique. So they go with these. I think I'm gonna put the gold on, not the antique. Right, here's gold, that's two gold. I want the gold. I'm going to have to find my little drill bit, ain't I? Not sure what I've done with it. One, two. Oh my god, these are tiny. <laughs> I think that's four. Is it four or is it eight? No, it's eight in it, you see. Okay, that's four each. That's four each. Okay, so that will be them. And then I'm going to put them once. These were, I can't remember how much I paid for them now. It's five pounds, six pounds, something like that. These are a little bit bigger. So I want. One of them each, and somewhere I should have the clips. Let me find another one. Here's one. Okay. I think I'm going to be doing these for uh, Christmas. 
definitely in love with the Christmas. So I want four each again. These ones. Two. Four. I'm going to go straight out with it. That was, couldn't do that again if I tried. Okay. So I'm going to put you on pause for a minute because I've got to find my um, little hand drill. So back in a minute. Okay, found my little screw, uh, little drill thing. Okay, so that goes with them. No, it doesn't. See, care. That goes with them. And then these, okay, these. Right, not a clue how I'm doing this. I've never done it before. So, do they go on the outside like that? No, they go on the inside, I think, don't they? Do they go on the inside? Okay. Wish me luck, peeps. I know what I'm going to do. Two secs. All of a sudden, my brain's got in gear. Another set of pens. Mm, will that do? Yes, it will. Okay. Don't forget your lid. It doesn't even sit in there properly, it's stupid. Oh, there goes another lot of ink. Oh! Oh, everything's falling apart on me. <laughs> right, let's put you over there for a minute. And let's concentrate on this one. Right. So, what I'm going to do is... I suppose it doesn't really matter which way the hinge goes, does it? Mm, I can't open it now. Oh, it does. Okay, so it's got to go that way. Okay, so. I'm going to have one there. One there. And I'm going to do... One there. And one there. Um, probably doesn't matter if they're a bit out because I'm just doing it by eye. Uh, got me a little ruler. Got me a little metal ruler that goes with me set. So that's like three and a half, four and a half. Oh look, there's not far off, is it? Literally. Okay, I just want to give it a start. Oh god, I can't see properly. Blind as a bleating bat I am. Okay, so that's one. These are lovely little things, but at the same time, they are a nightmare because they don't stay tight, if you know what I mean. Oh, <laughs> she says, chucking it all around. Okay, so... Oops, I've knocked you again. I do apologise. And held it up at the other one. There's one. I can't see the other one. <laughs> Put one on there. 
main one here. I hope we've done it again. I do apologise. <laughs> you feel, feel seasick yet? <laughs> oh dear. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Right. I don't want to go too far down because these are only tiny little screws. Right. This is going to be fiddly. This is going to be fiddly. Okay, it goes that way. In that hole. And put that there. Now, what I've done is, as I'm holding it in there, <clears throat> I'm pushing this up against the uh, my finger up against it. Oh, I might have done the holes a bit too deep. Um, because then it's up against this this bit. But then saying that, it looks. I think it feels a bit pissed. <laughs> right. So that needs to go down more. Oh, I've done it again. Sorry, people. I really don't mean to. Right, that's better. Honestly. <laughs> I'm going to put a um, claim, disclaimer thing up. If you feel if you suffer with a seat sickness, don't watch my videos. <laughs> oh dear, sorry. My stupid sense of humour. I think it's brilliant they've um, sent it with the screwdriver because you don't have to worry then and fight fight it right so let's go in there and that will come that way so it'll come there won't it off well it is a bit pissed that one isn't it sorry shouldn't say that <laughs> this is gonna be awkward. Awkward, awkward, awkward. Okay, so that one three and a half in. That one doing three and a half in. But I don't want it there. And then it's literally one between them, between the holes. So that will go to about there. I hope that's right. <laughs> oh, I'd better do this end as well, wouldn't I? That goes to three and a half. Is that three and a half? Yeah. Three and a half. And the other one goes to about four and a half, just under. All right. I'm going to try dr drilling. Um, can you see if I'm doing that? Can you see what I'm doing? Sorry. I want to literally just start it. Put a hole there. Oh, get off. 
Oh, can I get you again? <laughs> okay. This is going to be interesting. I don't know what I'm going to do. To put it down like this. I think. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> Come on, please play the game. That one's gone in. That one's better. That's better. Oops on the floor and that one hmm that one don't want to go in the owl come here silly thing do this one first then <laughs> oh, fingers and thumbs fingers and thumbs I'm sorry I can't show you what I'm doing properly Basically, I'm just finding the owl and screwing it in. <laughs> but I've got a feeling I might have missed... Oh, God's sake. Might have misjudged the distance. Not very good at doing things like that. Quite often make a mess. It's like when, you, when you put um, a picture up. And you've got two hooks to it. <laughs> yeah, right, okay. It ain't going to happen for me. Because when I do it, I end up with about five holes instead of two. <laughs> That's in one side. <laughs> right. I'm surprised. Now, if you find it's not strong enough... I suppose you could always take it out. Oh, look at that. No, <laughs> cute. You could always take it out and put a bit of um, glue or something because that's just turning now, isn't it? Which is annoying. So they might come out and I might have to put a bit of glue in. Yeah, that one is a bit, um, <laughs> had a bit to drink, I think. But then saying that, I've got it literally square. There you go. Sits in there just right. Okay. Catch. Oh, I might have, put, might have got these a bit big. Do, 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 do. Right. I'll do it that way. Ah. Um, what did I do with that there? Okay, so we are fifth. Fifty, yeah, uh, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So it's nine, isn't it? So it's nine is the centre of that. So that is the right way. I've got no. Oh, I was like blinking down, didn't I? No, you. Have I got it upside down? I got it upside down. Oh, these aren't going to be no good, are they? They're going to hang over the top, look. I didn't think of that. Hmm. Yeah. Me latches aren't no good. I'd have to think of something else for them. And, uh... See if I can get something different. But other than that, there you go, people. It's not perfect, but then I'm not perfect. So, 
when it comes to these, I'm going to get my UV um, and find the torch. Oh, gradually getting to know where everything is. Okay, so I'm going to get my stick. I don't know if this is going to work. open all right i'm gonna put some of this here if it will come out or i have to get a new ball okay i'm gonna to have to get a new ball but that will do for now i'm just gonna fill it up I just don't want this sharp for my grandkids. I should be playing with it anyway. But there you go. Who knows with the kids? Give it a cure. Now, I have to work quick with USB because, no, not with USB. <laughs> I don't know where that one come from. <laughs> With UV. Because um, I sit in front of a window. So I have to be pretty quick. I am just building it up bit by bit. to find my other UV. Oh, at it. <clears throat> so I'm just going to give it a cure here and that's all I'm doing with it and it should hopefully be enough. It might need a little bit more. A little tiny, tiny, tiny bit. But it's not sharp. No, it's not sharp. Oh, got to make sure it's cured. For the UV, I'm using the T-Expert. I bought, um, I think it was three bottles of it in one go. Oh, excuse me. Right, I'm going to give that a little bit more, a little bit more resin. Oh, no. No, no. I'm just going to do the rest of it like it. Look, there's another big one there. Don't want it dripping down. But I want it to fill the hole. Okay, there we 
do for that one. Let's give it a cure up. Big ones over there. Big one there. Oh, it's starting to cure them. <laughs> Helps if I actually move the light away, doesn't it? Honestly, some pipe. Sometimes people, I really don't know where 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 I am. Right, leave that for that. So, when it comes to the bottom, it has got a bit of a sharpness to it. Um, just going to give it a... There goes the rest of my ink. <laughs> I'm so useless with this. It's not even cutting it off, is it? And that's took the sharpness off on that bit anyway. I'm definitely going to have to put some of my ink somewhere else. <laughs> I think every time I put, do a video, I knock them flying. at all and there you go what I might do uh, I might I can really think of. I was going to put something on here on the top. Uh, never mind. There you go, people. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please um, give me a thumbs up if you've enjoyed this one. Um, share if you want to, if you think other people would like to see this. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, I would love it if you would, if you haven't. Um, uh, hit the notification bell <laughs> so you know when I'm going to upload. 
Um, oh my god, I can never remember them all. You know which ones I mean. So anyway, thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed that. I think it's gorgeous. Thank you. Ta-da!